Hello, this video is going to help you differentiate a ruptured Baker cyst from a calf tear on ultrasound. A good rule of thumb is that the fluid collection from a ruptured Baker cyst in the calf is typically located superficial to the muscle in the subcutaneous fat layer. In this cine clip, you can see from proximal to distal that the fluid collection is isolated superficial to the muscle. You can use the extended field of view feature to try to track it up to the popliteal fossa to see if it connects to a partially ruptured Baker cyst. In this case, it did. This is a cine clip going in the short axis from proximal to distal from the Baker cyst and the popliteal fossa through the calf. In this example, the fluid has internal echoes from hemorrhage, but may also be simple. The difference in the appearance with a calf tear is that the fluid collection is going to be located deep to the fascia that lies between the subcutaneous fat and the muscle. In this example, it's easier to tell on the short axis. Fluid may be located intramuscular or within the aponeurosis. In this case, it's just deep to the fascia within the muscle belly. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to read the description and add a comment if you have something to add. And please remember to like. Have a great day.